welcome to my YouTube channel. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell to be notified for all my future videos. Vamos a empezar. Hola, welcome back to my channel, Diara with Anais. I hope you're doing amazing today. I wanted to do another video, y'all, because y'all know I already got a nice, cute little PR package from Dipped and Dusted and Nails. And I wanted to do the second part of it because I already did one nail look with half of it with this, this cute little strawberry one. Now I want to do another nail look with the black hole color and with the star above color which is like a glitter with like stars and moons and it reflects into like brown and gold like it's just really really pretty now i did want to let y'all know i have a code with dipped and dusted nails and the code is anais10 make sure you check that out and use that she not only sells um sample sizes which is these but also sells 0.25 ounces and cute little coupons and oatmeal scrubs and body scrubs like honestly it's amazing so go ahead and check that out now today since we got a really really deep black and um pretty stars above themed nails i was like might as well just do some galaxy color blocking type nails and i was kind of like going for um yin and yang right so it's like black and, and white so like the opposites kind of attract so i don't have her liquids yet um but i do have double dipped liquids and i also have a code and i use 10 so you can use that too if you want to shop so i use my liquid my base and kind of go into like um kind of like a, a swift motion like a, a snake kind of motion um kind of doing like a ziggy zag <laughs> motion um, I basically just want to do half black and half glitter. So I don't I didn't want it to be like completely straight lines. I wanted it to have like some flow and some like a rhythm to it. So I was very spontaneous about which directions my colors were going. I did not plan it out. I literally was just like I want this section to be black i want this section to be gold and just kind of flowed with it so that's how i pretty much did it i went ahead and used the base to do that and you dip and you want to let it completely dry um just so it doesn't get messed up now when i clean my nails a lot of people like to use um toothpicks they like to use um there's like special tools for it sometimes if you go into the dip world you can literally get lost but i personally like to use um a silicone tool just because the silicone tool doesn't um spread the dip around number one number two it takes off what i want it to take off and it doesn't like mess with um what the look that i'm trying to do so i really like the silicone tool that i've been using lately it's it works best for me um that doesn't necessarily mean you can you have to use it too it's just what works best for me now i'm going ahead and just wiping everything off like all the access i want to let it dry completely and then i'm going in again with a second layer and this layer is um going on top of the black and i just want the black to be like as dark as possible and y'all i'm not gonna lie like i was kind of nervous to use the black because when i've used blacks before they like stain my cuticle nails and i promise y'all i did not have a problem with this it didn't stain my nail mind you i did have a peel off base coat but still did not stain my nail did not stain my cuticle i was very very impressed with the quality of black and it was just a pretty black I'm not gonna lie like it was just a nice solid black and i would use it for just a regular black mani um yeah, but I really appreciated the quality on that black one. Um, it's called Black Hole. So, um, as you also know, um, I am a brand ambassador. So, I do get, like, to view the new stuff coming out. And although this is from the first launch um, that happened not too long ago, there is another launch coming out this Friday. So make sure you check that out. I already got a preview and girl, 
oh my god i literally want to buy like all of them because they're so pretty so make sure you take advantage they are coming out very soon and you want to use a code any one of our codes would work but my code is anais10 that way you can save some money because girl these are really good quality these are from a small business a latina owned business and a woman owned business so y'all we gotta support our small businesses so definitely do that so all right so for the next section of my nails i'm just cleaning everything off because i didn't want it all over my skin but look it doesn't stain like i was so shocked y'all so the next section i am using the base coat and going in with the glitter now i didn't do two coats of glitter because this glitter was very 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 pigmented it was a perfect one dipper so if you ever wanted to use it on one dip you're fine like you you would not need um and a second dip unless you really wanted to so um that's completely up to you that's your preference but i am doing the same thing for all of my nails just dipping on now the negative space and cleaning off everything with my silicone tool and like i said i love my silicone tool because um it cleans perfectly it doesn't like stain anything um it just works out really pretty all right so i'm gonna let y'all watch that and i will come back did was clear cap and the only reason why i clear capped is because i have chunky glitter on my fingers and i do not want that to get messed up so clear capping is always important now you can do it with dip if you like you can also do it with poly gel you can do it with um builder gel you can do it with acrylic you can do it with whatever you want i just did it with dip because i'm using dip so might as well just stick with dip um now i do have dip flu which is why i don't talk throughout dip videos um i just get really really bad allergies when i do dip so you know that's not gonna stop me from doing nails because <laughs> i'm stubborn but it just prevents me from talking throughout my videos i'd rather just put double mask and call it a day and do my nails because if not i will just never be able to do videos for y'all so 
Okay, so next thing I did was add activator after I cleaned everything off. You want to make sure to clean everything off. I made the mistake once before of like putting the activator and I didn't even clear um, the clear. I didn't even clean the clear. So what ended up happening was the clear actually got stuck to my cuticle. So don't do that mistake, please. Clean your nails fully and thoroughly. finished filing i go ahead and clean everything off and it's really important to do this before you put a top coat on so your underneath your nails are not like all bumpy and all messy like you want to just make sure you do that now i don't like using like the top coat that dip comes with i just think it's really annoying and it takes too long to dry so i am very very lazy when it comes to this i'd rather put a top coat a gel top coat and cure it and call it a day honey okay so that's exactly what i did and i cured that for 60 seconds and this is how it came out y'all like i said look how pretty that black is like it's so opaque like it's just perfect 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 and then of course i used dipped and dusted nails cuticle oil this one was fruity and y'all i already told y'all this smells like fruity pebbles so take advantage new stuff is coming out this week make sure you use my code and i use 10 to save some money but y'all thank y'all so much for watching i hope you enjoyed watching my galaxy nail slash color blocking with dip i am really trying to get better with this dip thing so I really appreciate all of your support. If you're not a part of that DIY family, make sure you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell to be notified for all my future videos. And give this video a thumbs up if you liked it because y'all know it really helps these small channels out. <laughs> Thank y'all again so much. And as always, nos vemos en la próxima. Hey.